What is up guys, today we have the new for 2024 Illumination Minions 3.5 foot tall animated LED Minion. This was an animatronic that I was not even expected to ever see in my life or own in my life. And well, that has changed as you can see in front of me. I am GT Inflatables, also known as Galvar's Holiday Inflatable Channel, and let's get right into the video. If you're new here, please consider liking and subscribing because I do amazing animatronic and overall holiday themed videos. So that will really appreciate if you like and subscribe. So without further ado, let's get to the unboxing. I picked this guy up yesterday as a surprise. I, I was going to return my uh, Sword Reaper and a fog machine. I was going to get a the, the 8.5 pumpkin stack. But I saw this and I fell in love with it, so I got this instead. So I have to get these from those like top shelves from Home Depot because there's none left. I drove like 30 minutes and I waited 40 minutes in the store for them to bring it down. So it, I think it was all worth it. And I have opened this once, that's why you saw that orange tape there. But I'm gonna open it again for you guys. So here it is, this is the universal sticker here, or the print there. Here is all the instructions printed on the box. This is a fairly simple setup, but there's one step that is a bit tricky. I'll uh, tell you guys later about that. So there he is. He is absolutely massive. Here's my hand compared to it. That is huge. So let's get to the unpacking now. First up, we have the base. It has these candy cane stripe patterns here, which is a sticker. So I think if it, you know, is exposed to humidity or um, water, it might kind of peel off. But this prop is not meant for outdoor use anyway. So here we go. Here's his ginormous hat. It's filled with uh, stuffing right here. It's huge. Put that there. Now we have his leg, little his leg strap thing. We have one little leg. We have another leg. It is made out of a pretty good material. It's a hard plastic. Here we have an arm. As you can see right here, it is spring. It has a spring, and it's kind of a felt material for the arm. Um. So I think. I have to take out the whole minion, so I'll do just that, and I'll get right back. But before I do that, here is the other arm. So let me pull out the minion. So I have the minion pulled out. Here is the sensor. I love this little pouch right here. And here are all the mechanisms inside of it. This has a lot going on with this little motor all the way up to the mouth movement and the eyes. So that's the minion. He's enormous. Now we have his base, which feels really sturdy, so I like that. And then we have his other shoulder, I mean his uh, leg strap. And then we have three of these little compartments where you can take out the minion and, like, you know, connect the wires and stuff. So there's that. Last but not least, the instructions. So let's get to the building process. So first take the base and slide them, slide it into the little corresponding holes here. Then you're gonna go ahead and attach the feet. The one labeled D goes on your left, like this, and the one labeled C goes on to your right. Like, oh, not like that, like this. So it should be looking exactly like this right now. Next step, you're gonna take his little feet straps and strap them around with these Velcro pieces. So let's do that. Once you have the little sleeves attached, you're gonna go ahead and place the minion with these two little poles right here, and you're gonna snap lock them into the poles right here. So I'll show you what it looks like after I do that step. Okay, so there it is. I attached those snap locks to the feet, which took around 15 minutes because it's really hard to do this step. So the next step would be to put on the arms and the head and then just put these back on 
So, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, I'll show you what it looks like at the end. So, to put on the arms, just feed this little black metal piece right here and just attach it to that there. Attach it to here, same with the other arm. And then just put on the hat, plug in the adapter, and you're good to go. So, there you go. So, here is the demo. <laughs> guys that will conclude the video thank you guys for watching hopefully this video found you helpful so um yeah leave you know leave some comments like the video and subscribe most importantly if you haven't already so stay tuned and bye